The ghosts of my past are haunting me. Welcome back to Nanashi no Game, or for those of you who speak English, The Nameless Game by Square Enix, where we must go forward to figure out the horrors, the mysteries that lay within of the horrors that haunt this place ceaselessly. I think my friend might have actually died. A noble sacrifice, to be sure. However, I'm not entirely sure if he died or not. It's kind of vague. Oh well. I guess we'll find out soon enough, won't we? If we see his regret, then he's definitely dead. Because there's nothing that someone regrets more than being dead. I mean, if I was dead, I'd feel pretty regretful about being dead. I don't know about the rest of you. I think I understand how this flashlight works. I think it actually is a point light, but the thing is, there's also a fog effect slapped onto it, so... Yeah. All it does is it brightens up the fog, so it just becomes the color of the fog, if that even makes any sense. At least until the fog, at least until I'm enough in the fog to actually make out shapes in the fog. Well, okay. Hello. Well, okay then. Who's that on the bed, huh? Well, at least you're going in another direction, huh? You're coming towards me, aren't you? Oh, crap. Maybe I should leave. Yeah, I think I stumbled upon something I should not have. And by that, I mean I took too long to act. I gotta run. Oh. Or I just had to leave and come back. And then you'll be gone completely. Awesome. That certainly makes things a lot easier for me, doesn't it? Also, the... No, wait, it's still there. It's just on a different bed than I thought it was on. I was about to say, the, the little girl drawing is gone, but no, it's not. It's still there. It's still there. What in the world happened here? Wait. Is that a little girl, or is that a monster, or is that a woman who died? Because that looks like long hair and a yellow dress, so maybe it's the mother, and that was her depiction of dying? I've honestly got no idea. What I do know is this place is creeping me out. I should probably do something about that. Where the hell can I go? It just seems like a dead end here. Dead being the operative word. Oh well, I guess it's time to leave. Wait. Oh, about to say. That's not a proper door, that's an opening. Ah, the doorknob is removed. I cannot use that door. Whether it's a bathroom or a closet or whatever. Alrighty then. Time to move forward then. That room was a waste of time. Blood. And it opens. This isn't gonna be good, is it? I hear static. That means there's a spook nearby. This is gonna get nasty. It's gonna get quite ugly in here. What the? Wait, what just happened? Did did it just crash? Did it seriously just crash? I honestly can't tell. Because it's not closing, but it's not responding to me either. Okay, now I know it crashed. Hang tight real quick.
There, now I'm back. This time I used a safe state just in case it crashes again. Normally I try not to use safe states, but I think this is extenuating circumstances. What the hell? It's that same figure again, except this time, it's in the head. Well, that's not good, is it? And this door actually has a doorknob, so... Can I... can I work it? Nope, of course not. Just having a doorknob doesn't mean you can actually open it! Or even attempt to open it. Things are getting creepier. But that's the whole point of the game, isn't it? slowly drive you insane. It won't open. Of course not. You're not where you need to be yet. You need to go further. Further beyond. It won't open. I'm sure I'll get there eventually. It won't open. Of course it won't open, you daft moron. It's obviously locked. This one is not. Another one of those. Wow, okay. Someone just ripped out a chunk of this place. Holy crap. Holy is right. This room is holy. So many holes. So many holes! won't open? It won't open? Oh. It's probably that door right there. The big metal door. Of course it's none of these doors. I gotta go upward into hell. That way if I get back into a corner, it'll actually be a fatal fall if I have to jump out the window. Oh, fantastic. I hear something shifting. Holy crap, that one's actually pretty fast. Thankfully, he's in a preset pattern. Which means I could probably avoid him pretty easily if I try. Thankfully, the left side is zoomed in a little bit, so it actually cuts through the fog a little better. Are you serious? <laughs> oh, that's great. If you're already opening the door, you clip right through them. Okay, time to run. Got a blast. Hurry up. There's a spook right behind you, dude. Anywhere that you can go is good. Oh no. I hear a groaning. Does that mean there's one in front of me too? Or does that just mean that it's the one behind me? Nope, there's another one guarding that door. That means I have to go through here, right? It won't open. Oh snap. Snap, crackle, pop. Well, I'm boned, aren't I? Why didn't anyone tell me about this? There's nowhere to go. I'm trapped. You gotta be kidding me. This sucks. Oh. Disappeared, huh? That's right, you better run! Didn't want to do none of this! <laughs> you didn't want any of my... Tiger skills. Actually, more like my cheetah skills. Because I run away really fast. Nick, 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 nick. Oh, great. It's debris. Isn't that always nice? Maybe if I go back, the girl in the red dress will be gone, too. I can hope. One can always hope. Are you 
still there? Are you still there? No one is here. Nap time. Huh. It's like some kind of dining hall. Dining room. Not hall. Asahi? Oh boy. She's dead. Is she dead? No, 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 it couldn't be. She, she's dead? Well, this just got a lot more disturbing. You came all this way. Why? Why have you come for me? I tried to kill you, but you still came for me. Not even Papa came for me. I hate games so much. Games are what took my Papa away from me. Games are what killed my Mama. Please tell me. Why hasn't Papa come for me? I've been waiting for him. I've waited a long, long time. Why hasn't he come for me? I've been watching. I've waited a long, long time. Such a very long time to wait for Papa. I'm sorry. I don't think your Papa is in the right state of mind to come for you anymore. I saw him drooling. Asahi? She's gone. It's okay, Asahi. You don't have to be alone anymore. You don't have to be afraid anymore. I'm here for you, Asahi. I'm sorry. I wish Mama and Papa and me could watch the sunrise together again. So that was the last page of that diary. Now it makes sense. Is it over? Is the curse over? The music is no longer fearful. It's actually joyful. I feel I feel like I accomplished something here. She's finally at peace. My work here is done. I guess it's time to leave now. <laughs> Gotta love the warm feeling it gives you. Ah, the feeling of accomplishment. That's what the best games can inspire, after all. Uh-oh. Great, now to break up the this peaceful moment, right? If you're still reading this, then you must still be okay. That's good. I know I'm late, but I'm on my way. I'm almost at the old road. Come down here quickly and meet me. It's not over yet. This music... It's... It's deceptive. How dare you? How dare you make me think that everything is okay? You deceitful little... No, I'm not gonna listen to you anymore. Is this where I die? I teleported. Well, what do you know? Great. It's him. He's here to tell him something's gonna happen. I'm at the entrance of the tunnel now. I'm waiting for you. Try to make it here safe and sound. Same to you. I get the feeling you're not going to be so lucky, are you? Great. Man, my heart just crept up into the inside of my throat. The music was so peaceful, too. I thought it was finally over. That was clearly... Me being delusional, overly optimistic. Capes Lighthouse. Indeed. I thought that minute was over. I thought that meant we could put this behind us, but no. Clearly, the hell has only just begun. 
Well, time to move on through this water infested tunnel. I'm sure it's just a tunnel and not a sewage system. But wait, I thought Odaka was already here because did he insert himself into the game? He was in the game and he was fending them off for me. So how is he... How did he just now arrive? Did he basically just turn on the game himself and uh, somehow influence events? That doesn't even make any sense. But I suppose all will be revealed in the end, right? Right. Got it. The door. I can't wait to play the sequel. Should be even better than this one, right? More tunnels! More ways to die! It may be summer, but the nights are still cold. Maybe it's because we're so close to the sea, but I'm freezing. My fingers are numb. Professor. He's dead. Holy crap, he's running. He's gunning it. Open the door. Open up. Huh. Whew. What the? Who's... Is it time for one last game already? Hooray! This is where it all goes to hell. Oh boy. Now I just have to get out of here, right? All you want to do is save yourself. You're just like him. I'm not- I'm not like him! I wanted to help you! I seriously wanted to save you! That's not true. I'll never forgive Papa for choosing games over me and Mama. You should. I'm sure he loved you. You shouldn't hold a resentment against him forever. You should find forgiveness. Hatred only leads to hellish things. Papa stayed alive while we had to die. I'm sure if your Papa knew you were in danger, he would have protected you with his life. He didn't know. He had no way of knowing. No one had any way of knowing. Sorry, but that means I have to kill you too. You don't have to do this, little girl. You don't have to do this. You can find forgiveness in your heart. You can let yourself free of this hatred. Still not giving up? You mean you want more pain? No, I want to free you. I'm trying to help you. I'm not going to give up on you. That's why I'm avenging her. You don't have If you want to do if you want to avenge her then kill the guy who killed her. Mama hates him too, you know. No, she wouldn't. She wouldn't hate him. You're wrong. Your your mother wouldn't hate him. She would understand. I killed the people who made this awful game. I'm just a bystander in all this. I hate everyone who plays games! Why? What do they do to you? They didn't... They didn't force your dad to... work tirelessly. I'll never forgive him! I'll never forgive games! And I'll never forgive you! Oh, crap. It's the same music. 
with Rico, isn't it? Oh boy. Oh crap, who's behind me? Is it her? Is it the girl? I don't see anyone chasing me. But I'm pretty sure I should run anyway. I don't want to risk it. I need to get the hell out of here. I've got a very bad feeling about this. There's an arrow pointing me towards the light. Or towards my death, I've got no idea. I gotta make sure again, okay. It is in the proper orientation. I'm doing this for your sake. To make sure. Are the arrows pointing me towards my safety or my hell? I have no idea. This is getting bad. Little girl, Asahi, I'm here to save you. I was here to help you. I just want to help. I'm not just here to save myself. If I was here to save myself, well, then clearly it wouldn't have worked. How could I, how could I possibly save myself? There's no way. There's no way to save myself from this. It's impossible. Are you okay? This mail is set to automatically send itself to automatically from my office PC in case something happens to me. I wanted to ask you, what do you think that drawing in Odaka's flat meant? The lighthouse. Is that what you're talking about? The graffiti from Odaka's room? I'm sure it was a drawing of a lighthouse. Wait, a lighthouse? There was one on the last page of that diary, too. I think there's a lighthouse in this area. I'll head there right now. Yeah, I probably should. Does this mean this door can be opened? Yes, it does. The game isn't over yet, holy crap. Just when you think it's over, it... It keeps unpeeling itself like an onion. The final day. Sure, why not? Not that it'll do me any good, but hey. Four days left, three days left, two days left. Eh, forget it. Overwrite data. I can always just use save states if I want. But I actually want to go to specific days. Seven Capes Lighthouse. I couldn't tell if that I actually couldn't tell if that was part of the, still part of the cutscene or not. Until I realized, oh, it's it's much higher resolution because of the emulator. Also it's not artifacting nearly as badly. Can't wait. This ought to be fun. Is that her? Little girl. Are you alright? I'm here for you. If I was just here to save myself, I would have kept running. But I didn't. Come here. It's all right. I'm not here to hurt you. No one's here to hurt you anymore. Oh great, she's a regret too. She's one of them. Of course she is. And I'm gonna regret going in here. I hear stepping. Is it getting closer or more distant? No, wait. It's coming from behind me, isn't it? I want to check, but I'm afraid to. You know what? I'm just doing this for the sake of knowing. Where are you? Oh. Oh. Now there's no longer anyone stepping after me. Sorry about that. Oh, hello. Little girl. It's okay, I'm not here. I'm not afraid. And you shouldn't be either. I'm a friend. I'm not here to hurt you. It's okay, little girl. You're among friends here. 
Yeah, yes, haha. -ha. Uh, that's a funny little prank you're pulling on me. You really are funny, aren't you? Uh, give me a hug. Or not. Well, that's what I get for trying to hug someone. Maybe I shouldn't just hug strangers. Important life lesson for us all, uh huh? Don't not approach the little girl just because she seems scared. Because she still has the power to kill you. Yes, that's funny. You're you're a real comedian, aren't you, Joker? <laughs> we must kill the Batman. Can I be two-faced and determine my fate with a coin toss? At least give me a chance. Okay. That's great. Yep. All I gotta do is stop moving. Do not touch. Don't touch Willy. Good advice. Uh, I think the stairwalk is going to be the death of me. Either because a little, either because a vengeful little girl is going to kill me, or because the stairs will do it. Hello, little girl. Are you having fun screwing with me like this? Seriously. Okay, okay. The game crashed again. Hang tight again. And after what seemed like an eternity, Stanley finally made his way up. What he will find beyond is anyone's guess. I see that sound as the door. Oh, great. Am I going to get chased through this? This looks like the perfect venue for a chase scene. Oh, hello, little girl. You're not jumping, are you? You're not gonna jump, are you? No. No! Now you're really messing with me. Come on, that's not nice. What is wrong with you? Seriously. What is this little girl's malfunction? WHAT IS YOUR MAJOR MALFUNCTION?! Talk about dad issues. Huh? What the? Oh, uh, okay. Is it time to head down again? You know what? I'm gonna find out. That's a long way down, so, uh, hang tight again. I finally reached the bottom. What's my prize? The realization that it's still not over yet? Wait a minute. What's over here? Okay, the door is opening. Not long until morning. What the? So I have to get out of here in three minutes? What the hell? Okay. So I have to get out of here before morning? Oh, crap. Regrets. They're haunting me. That guy's got a cinder block on him. Did he sleep with the fishes or what? This is getting intense. Every twist and turn makes me more and more anxious. This is getting crazy.
What's going on here? Are they just repeating themselves now? That's another one with a concrete block. Wait. Am I just going around in circles? Oh crap, that better not be the case. Nope, there are three of them, it's something different. Of course, it's the family, right? Which one's the daughter, though? I don't think any of them are the daughter. I think that's just another scene. They really do not give you enough time here. Or maybe they do, and I'm just ignorant. It's you! You're the one who caused all of this! There's the bastard in question! The psycho! With the glasses! And the blood! You bastard! This is all your fault! You caused this! You tainted that little girl! It's the bench in the game! Crap, that's not the end. What do I have to do? Do I have to jump in? Go for a swim? What do I gotta do here? Give me a clue! Wait, I have a hunch. I'm not sure if it's the right one, so... Just in case... I'm gonna save. So, I'm gonna go straight here, and then... I'm gonna open my TS. Is that what I was supposed to do? <clears throat> or not? I've got no idea. What do I have to do here? It's a dead end. Literally. Do I have to go back to that guy? Is that what I have to do? I wish it was more clear. Sir? Dead, sir, clearly? Do you mind telling me what I'm supposed to do here? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Well, I may as well face the sun's the sunrise. I may as well face the sunrise. Let's see what happens. Since I clearly didn't make it. Of course. You, you just die instantly. There's not even any sequence for it. You just die instantly. Alright, hang tight again. I gotta figure out what to do here. I screwed up. I was supposed to examine the statues. I haven't been examining the statues. But how was I supposed to know that? Oh well, I guess I'll try one last time. Hang tight again. Okay, let's try this again. Not long until morning, got it. Okay, come on. Would you hurry up, please? Okay. Now let's get to this. This is the last... This is the last of it. We're getting down to the finale here. Which means I'm not going to stop playing until I beat it. Even if it goes way bo way out of my time. Okay, there we go. Is this Professor Uyama? Hits everyone who's died. Let me guess, the next one's going to be Riku. Riku, right? The ghosts of my past, indeed. No, wait, that's Odaka. I know now. The ghosts of my past are haunting me. No, wait, it is Rico. Examine. Damn it. For crying out loud. 
This isn't very responsive. This isn't working. Why isn't this working? Hang tight again, I guess. Doesn't want to work. Okay, I figured it out. You have to touch them and then it'll go through a TS... Uh, it'll go through a TS sequence with all of them. So I guess you have to set their souls at peace or something. I didn't realize that. I just figured you had to run from each one. My bad. Okay, here we go. Is this Professor Yami? Come on, fast forward. There we go. I can fast forward, thankfully. Medjun, there's something I haven't told you, Medjun. I might as well tell you as it's too late for me now that I'm in here. I was sent this cursed game the day before you were. Then you showed up in my office with your copy of the game. I knew then that I had a chance to conduct an experiment with myself as the subject. The experiment? Since you'd already started playing the game and trying to solve its mysteries, I wanted to see what would happen if I didn't play it at all. And the outcome of ignoring the game? Well, here I am. But coming inside the game, I think I understand everything. Asahi hated what games did to her life. That hatred extended to all those who make games and those who play them, but the whole reason Nakudo was working so hard on this game was because of Asahi. He was trying to atone for his past and the death of her mother, but it wasn't just that. He wanted to remember through all of that powerful hatred to remember the days they spent together as one happy family. Go, so now, you and I know the true meaning behind this cursed game, but Akuto's poor Udasoft colleagues died without ever knowing the true importance of what they were working on. I think it's only right to tell them the truth. I don't know if I'll be able to do it. Hurry, Medjun. Dawn is breaking on your final day. Dawn of the final day. Professor... Oyami. Professor Oyami. Yeah, it's... It sucks. Okay, hurry up. I'm gonna use tab. That fast forwards the game a bit. I got it. Come on. Okay. R Riku? Find peace. Be set free. There we go. Okay. Listen, Medjun. Asahi hates her father and the fact that he was away at work so much, but deep down she knows that hate isn't the right thing to feel for him. He is her father after all. That's why she wasn't able to kill him. Do it, Medjun. Tell Asahi the truth behind this game. Riku. I intend to. Don't you worry about that, Rico. I intend to put all of this right. Even if that means tabbing to fast forward through this. Because that's what must be done. Okay, here we go. Odaka? Here we go. Okay, come on. Hurry up. Medjun. All of Asai's hatred for this game and anyone who had anything to do with it. That great hatred is more than the opposite of her great love for her family. Only one who once loved so much could hate so much now. You know, when I see how much love Akuda put into making this game for his daughter, it makes me jealous. I mean, my family never had any money trouble problems. We didn't want any. We didn't want for anything material, but we just didn't have the love that Akuto and his family had. You have to make Asahi realize that, Medjun. Open her eyes. Odaka. I will, I'll do it for all of you. This is, this is the culmination. Crap, got stuck in the geometry there. Okay, it's time to tell the developers what really happened. It's time they get some closure as well. That woman from the hospital? Okay, come on. We gotta, let's, let's have a photo finish here. Akuto made this game just for Asahi. He poured his heart and soul into making a game filled not just with the crude violence found in so many games, but with a warm, all-embracing love. It was his passion that moved me to compose this melody. Oh. Great, I gotta do it all of them at one, one at a time? That guy from the hospital. I guess I'm not even gonna bother, uh, flipping it. I mean, there's no reason to, right? Okay, I got it. Akuto worked so hard on this game. His dedication really impressed me and inspired me to follow his example the best I could. 
as the programmer, and the end I had the same hopes for this game as him. He wanted to, we wanted to show the world that games are not just empty distractions. They can be used by one person to show how they feel. Man, that's that's deep. These were all, those were all Udus Udisoft employees. Uh, sir? Can we just get this on with? Fine, I guess I gotta do this. But I'm not gonna flip it again. Uh, sir? Is he not gonna talk to me? Okay, but I've only got one more minute left. Crap. Okay, now I think it's time for me to actually flip it back. Crap, only one more minute to go. Come on. We can do this. Only one more to go. That bastard. Oh, great. Now you show yourself, you prick. Douche. I call foul. I better not lose because of this guy. Okay, come on. Come on. Akuta wanted this game to be full of happiness, the memories of their family trip, a time and a place when they had fun and were happy together. After Tomoko was murdered, their lives were shrouded in grief. Akuto wanted to make a game for Asahi that would show her how much he loved her. He believed that one day she would be able to see past her sadness and remember all the love their family shared. I lost my mother when I was young too, so I was incredibly touched by what Akuto was doing. So I felt proud to be able to help him express himself as I drew the graphics for this game. Man, that's deep. Okay. It's time for me to finish this. Sorry about this, I keep keep tripping over myself. Okay, come on! Don't have much time to go. Hurry up. Of course. Okay, thankfully it thankfully that freezes the timer each time. Who are you? It's all my fault. Something inside me snapped. Work was just so tough, you know? I hated Akuto for making everyone work on this some game that was never going to be going to sell enough to make back our costs. But I suppose I was jealous too. My job was all I had in my life, but not Akuta. He was doing it all for his family. I know that I can never apologize enough for what I did. But now, at the end of it all, I understand. I know it's really the most important thing to people. Asai is sitting on a bench up ahead of the cape. You should tell her how Akuta felt. Make her realize what I've been able to realize, what's really important. Yutani. I can't believe I'm s sympathizing with this guy. The brutal murderer who made all this happen. Okay. This is the end of the wire. Come on. Crap. It's not good enough. I have to be staring right at her, don't I? Listen. It's very important. Okay, good. I made it. I made it! Time to save. One last game. It's almost over. All this will soon be coming to an end. I only wish I could make it to the end sooner. Where is she? Where is she? I don't see her anywhere. She has to be somewhere, right? This door is open, but that doesn't prove anything. Especially when you can just go inside, you can open doors. Where is she? Where is she? Damn it. I don't mean to be in a rush, but why have you come here? He loved Tomoko so much. It was a very modest ceremony held in the tiny chapel. But with Tomoko by his side, he looked so happy that the place might as well have been filled with flowers. I see. This is very horrible. I can never forgive him for that. Getting married changed Akuto. He worked so much harder, even more so when little Asai came along. So that's it. He did it all for her and she hated him for it. 
Man, that's tragic. But he wasn't, and that's why you got... If only Papa had been with us. This is getting... This is... This is several layers of... Crazy. Come on. But it's his fault I died, Mama! I can't forgive them! Not after what happened to my poor Mama! Mama! Asahi, darling. I'm not sad because I had to die. I wish I could have stayed with you and your father, our little family. But that isn't the worst thing to me. What grieves me more is that you had to die, darling. That and the fact that you still haven't forgiven your father. That's the saddest thing of all. It's over. Good. He's here. Mr. Akuda! Oh, Asahi. Really? I was so happy. First I met your father and he made me very happy. Then we were bo you were born and made me happier still. I was so happy to be with you both. I see now. Tomoko, you guided me here, didn't you? To Asahi's side. Asahi, it's all my fault. Everything. I left you and your mother alone. Her murder. You're closing up your heart. It's my fault. I know it's too late to ask for forgiveness, but that's why I made the game. It was for you. I wanted you to understand how I felt about you. Papa! Aw, look at that. She's no longer cursed. It's over. I'm still alive. I made it. Who are you? I feel like we've met before. What ho, we've met... Can I ask you something? What is it? What happens next? In the game, in this story? You really want to know? Yes! I suppose I should write the rest of the story. To make up for what I did to my family. Okay. Now it's over. Unfortunately, I didn't get the good ending. Although... You know what? It, it doesn't matter. If you want to see the good ending, I'm sure someone already uploaded it on YouTube. I don't feel the need to go back and collect all the item, all the secret items just to get the good ending when... If you really want to watch the good ending, you can just watch it on YouTube. But anyway, I'm actually... It's a shame this never came to the States because it's a really cool game. I, I mean, I guess I could understand how shooters wouldn't... Shooting fans wouldn't be into it, but the DS wasn't exactly, uh... A hardcore shooters only affair. It had games of all types. That, so I don't get why Square Enix's focus group told them, oh no, it'll never sell in the States. I I have to disagree with that. A huge deal. Because I enjoyed it. For for DS standards especially, the game is quite atmospheric at points. And I'm surprised the the number of layers it went to. And the, the fact that the game looks like 8-bit Final Fantasy, you know, a game made by Squaresoft, which became Square Enix, that, that just adds a whole other layer onto it. It's, it's pretty interesting about a cursed video game. The plot is pretty interesting, too. It's basically just the ring with a video game, so it's kind of basically introduced in a new format, so to speak. It's not the most, cr it's not the most original thing in the world, obviously, not by a long shot, but it's definitely a lot of fun. Road to Sunshine. Sunrise. Sorry, that sunshine. Sunrise. Yep, I didn't get the good ending, so... <laughs> Download complete. Med Jun. Med Junkie. Save clear data. Wait, what? Square Enix. Epics. Digital Entertainment. Act Imagine. Blind Terror. Okay, I guess that is the nameless game. Hope you enjoyed it. I certainly did. The, 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 this game features 3D sound. What the? What the? Oh, wait, never mind. You know what? I'm just going to end this here. That is it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like vengeful little girls. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. The next stop is the nameless game me.
Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and pleasant day. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon or just check out the end screens right here.